El proyecto Fibra Austral 2 nace como, una, como un hito más que representa los principios que impidieron a Telefónica del Sur allá por el año 1893, en que los pioneros, ¿cierto? Y, y su principal intención fue crear una empresa que permitiera comunicar a la gente del sur. Es así como el año 2013, como empresa, comenzamos a evaluar eh, la, eh, la necesidad de poder mejorar la conectividad que tenemos de Puerto Montt a Coyhaique. En esa idea eh, se diseñó este proyecto que nos permite dar una mayor confiabilidad a las telecomunicaciones del sur. So, the Intrepid uh, was brought down here in, uh, in southern Chile, in uh, the Gulf of Corcovado area, so that we can install a new fiber optic cable system that uh, is for Telsur. And uh, basically the cable is from NSW and we loaded it in Germany. So from Germany, Uh, we came down to Chile and we're doing the install um, of two segments. The first uh, segment one is in the north from Calbuco to uh, Linao. It's 38 kilometers. Um, and then the second segment is a longer one. It's 354 kilometers. And it's from uh, Chacabuco all the way to the shore end here in Cayon. And uh, the process is that if we get a, a damage or we join two pieces of cable together, We go into our workshop area, uh, we take the two ends, we prep it, uh, we join them together for strength, and then we take the fibers and we fuse them, fuse them with our fusion machine, and coil them into a tray, put protection over it, and then it's ready to pay out over the stern. Before we pay it out, we use our OTDR, which is up here, to uh, test the fiber to make sure that there's no Uh, attenuations over and above the spec as put out for by the client or the manufacturer. Este trazado que estamos terminando hoy día, el tramo Chacabuco Quillón, es parte de un proyecto más integral que nos permitirá tener una ruta redundante eh, 100% entre Puerto Montt y Coyhaique. This, uh, this ship is uh, a special purpose-built cable ship. Okay, so it's uh... It was designed to do uh, mostly cable repairs, but also it can do cable installations. And we've done many around the world. It was built specifically for this, so it has machinery and design. The layout of the whole ship is just made for uh, fiber optic cables. That's why the ship is down here. It's because we can do this uh, in a controlled fashion, fairly rapidly and efficiently, and also keep costs down. I feel they're going to have a much better cable system, much better communications. Fiber is a very, very good system. It's, it's going to make things a whole lot better with regards to internet. Everything's going to be much faster. Cell phones are going to be much better. Everything. So it's good. People are going to love it. Lo único que nosotros esperamos como Telefónica del Sur es que nuestros clientes que van a recibir este nuevo proyecto, que gente totalmente dispuesta ha trabajado durante un año para poder tener eh, un resultado positivo y que redunde en mejores comunicaciones para el sur. And it's great to be able to now communicate uh, or bring them the communication, high speed internet and uh, better phone communication that can then carry on further south and that'll help uh, get Chile more connected, bring everybody together.